self-functioning turbine is both tumultuous and terrifying. Here are the top 10 wind turbine fails. Number 10. The Fire Failure of Klickitat County, July 2019 When a wind turbine fails, the consequences can be dire. And the turbine fail that happened in Klickitat County, Washington in July 2019 is a testament to that. The wind turbine's generator caught fire, causing sections of the turbine to melt. At first, the fire was 300 feet. Leaf Filter is rolling into neighborhoods to end gutter cleaning forever. On this side of the house, we see gutters. Wind turbines are relatively simple. As the blades turn, they turn a generator, and that generator creates electricity. Wow. Amazing. Hey everyone, we're back at the airfield and there's the Dreamliner, Her Majesty, there and we got the new wheels from Hobby King, uh, those are 70 millimeters, I'm so happy with the weather, we don't have... Imagine if we detonated a nuclear bomb in space, actually, you don't have to, you can see it for yourself. That was Starfish Prime the highest altitude nuclear test in history. In 1962, the US government launched a 1.4 megaton bomb from Johnston Island and detonated it 400 kilometers above the Pacific, about as high as where the International Space Station orbits today. The detonation generated a giant fireball and created a burst of energy called an electromagnetic pulse, or EMP, that expanded for over 1,000 kilometers. EMPs can cause a power surge, damaging electronic equipment in the process, and this one was no different. Across Hawaii, streetlights went dark, telephones went down, and navigation and radar systems went out. Not to mention the six or so satellites that failed. And all this came from a 1.4 megaton bomb. Tsar Bomba, which was the largest nuclear bomb that was ever detonated, was 50 megatons. So what would happen if we detonated that above the United States? For starters, there's no atmosphere in space, so there would be no mushroom-shaped cloud and no subsequent blast wave or